What's up? So I thought I would do a little voiceover on this one just to provide some context. Safety Diver Matt, big shout out to him, keeping everybody safe in the water. We did this one ocean dive on Oahu. It was a bucket list thing for me. Um, they kept everybody really safe and had us doing some drops here just to see if we could attract some of the sharks that were down. You can kind of see them at the distance there off the left side of your screen. Um, some of the bubbles and things like that they thought might attract some of the sandbar sharks that we could see down there to come up and hang out with us for a little while. Um, it does end up working here. As you'll see, I did about four drops. We only went, I don't know, between 15 and 20 feet probably. Nothing too deep, just spending some time and uh, trying to attract the interest of the sharks to come up. It was crystal clear, pouring rain, but very, very warm. I think on this drop is, uh, is probably the one where we started to get the best interest of, of sharks coming up and, and checking out on the opposite side of the boat just seeing what we were doing, seeing what we were about, and it was just a, a killer experience. So after a little while, they, they, they came up to check us out. They, were, they estimated about 70 in total of these sandbar sharks that just came up and, and surrounded us. They got really curious and wanted to just check out the motors and, and the bottom of the boat and um, our safety diver Matt again just was awesome about making sure just to keep everybody or at least an eye on everybody make sure that everybody was staying safe. We had this one you'll see at the center of your screen kind of take a little too much interest in me and they had uh, told us to stretch out our fins so that's what I'm doing here but luckily Matt comes in and just gives her a little boop on the nose just to send her in the other direction. I never felt nervous at all. There was no point where I was stressed about being in the water with the sharks. They were all so relaxed. No acts of aggression or anything like that. Just kind of drifting on the current, hanging out. Sandbar sharks, I guess, are some of the favorites of the uh, the workers, the safety divers and stuff, just because they're always so fun to see and so curious and, and uh, definitely come in to see what you're doing there, hanging out in their neck of the woods. It was super amazing. I felt like I could have stayed in here for hours, but um, after a while, you could you could tell they were uninterested now in, in us and what we were doing. We were just boring and kind of started to go away and drop back down. It was at this point that uh, safety diver Matt had us come out and start doing some more drops. He calls me out here, um, come out towards this sandbar shark and maybe take a drop on her and see if we can't stir up a little more interest. She kind of starts to fade away and he decides to send me in the opposite direction. There's going to be two views of this. Uh, versus this is my view as I check to make sure I, I got eyes on that sandbar and cruise down towards the school below that you can see and all of a sudden I just feel a something grab my fin and, and grab my ankle and pull me back and, and right here off in the distance you can kind of make out a, a silhouette uh, and you'll kind of see here this is my brother Justin he was GoPro in the same the same time it's pretty rare this time of year in November is when we went and it's it's pretty rare to see tigers out in this area uh, but we were hoping we were sure hoping that, that we were going to be able to and that's what happens here Matt kind of doing his thing and surveilling and sees this big silhouette coming towards us and he 
swims down real quick to grab me and let me know pointing right here, pointing that silhouette out and, and does what he does best, just hops on the other side, gets in between myself and the shark. Um, again, not nervous at all, just really excited to see her coming in. I'm gonna see some video here as she gets closer and closer and then really came in close to, to check us out. She's just beautiful. Uh, this is Kalihi. I believe is what they said her name was. She's a resident tiger shark here on Oahu. Um, my guess is like 10 to 12 feet. Wasn't like the, the biggest tiger that's around, I'm sure, but she was just gorgeous and, and so calm and relaxed and just watching her in the water almost just brought this, this like calm, relaxing feeling of just floating along and super smooth movements and it was just amazing this is like a bucket list thing for for both myself and my brother matt then just uh shoots me back towards the boat he kind of just points and says hey take off and so i just swim back to the boat and and uh, kind of get a glance of her circling around as i as i cruise back everybody was really excited Kind of assessed some of the more experienced divers he grabbed this is the captain's wife actually he grabbed her and brought her out so that she could get a little closer view once he assessed that the that uh, the, the shark was being really relaxed and very very chill i was just on cloud nine and then luckily he uh he picked my brother as well to cruise out and get a dive with her just as she's turning to go away and we didn't end up seeing her again um, she just kind of took off and as, as quick as she came then she was gone it was one of the best experiences of my life I cannot tell enough people about it and if you're on Oahu they make it so safe they make it so great and I would highly recommend that you put this on your list of things to do I'll put a discount code at the end of the video that they gave us um, it was just it was amazing. They gave us these phrases that we could hashtag and put in our social media. So I appreciate you stopping by and checking it out. Got a couple of other videos of like the kid friendly snorkeling spots we went to. And other than that, you know, just definitely check these guys out. It was well worth it. Take it easy.